All yeah. right. All right, time now for our canine rescue of the week, because every Friday we like to give you a chance to adopt a dog or pet and make it part of your family. And this has been so cool to see the progress. But Kathleen Hunter is here from the Northwest Canine Coalition. Good, Good morning. morning. Hi. So welcome back. Thank you. Now you don't have a dog. Lady. I know. What's feels the story? weird. <laughs> I got it noticed late last night that a little chopper uh, was playing in the snow all week, like a lot of kids probably, and he came down with the sniffles. Oh. So he has a cold, and they decided it's best to not take him out today. So, um, but he's still available for adoption. He's doing oh. great. He's a little Pomeranian. He's 12 years old. And he's special. He's got some special needs. He he's, it makes him kind of unique. He Yeah, he's blind and deaf. But that doesn't slow him down at all. He walks well on a leash. Uh, he's great for one of those dogs. If you want a companion, almost 24-7, he would be perfect because he only weighs 12 little pounds. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. Um, he's also learning some new tricks. He's learning how to sit for a treat. Oh, nice. And um, he makes his way around the house fine, you know, just little taps on his little, little behind, and he'll redirect himself. And his backstory is pretty. You got him from a... Hawaii? It was a bad situation? He what, was, what was the he story? He was transferred from a shelter in Hawaii, which is um, common, one of the places that a lot of our rescues will bring dogs from Southern California, and Hawaii is a, another shelter. They get overcrowded, and, um, you know, bad things happen. Yeah. <laughs> sure. So uh, Little Chopper was one of the lucky ones who made it on a flight over here looking for his new home. He does great with other mellow dogs. In fact, he probably would welcome one. He likes to play with them. So if you have another dog already, he would be great. Um, yeah, he's just a real, real love bug. I was just thinking he would be good maybe for, I always think about, we get so many texts from seniors mm -hmm. who want a companion. Do you think he'd be good with he a senior? He would be perfect because he does need a little bit more hands-on attention because he can't see and he can't hear. So a senior would be perfect. They could just take him wherever they go. Mm -hmm. And they have really neat um, knapsacks now, kind of like a messenger bag, but it's a very lightweight. You could put chopper in there, take him with you wherever you go. Aww. And they have little windows in there. And 12 pounds is just, 12 I would pounds. Say, I don't, in a world with two huskies, this is, it's hard to imagine. I don't know. He, he probably weighs as much as your husky's paw. You I know, know right? <laughs> and we have good news. Chelsea, which is one of our dogs we've been talking about yes. recently, has been adopted. Chelsea was adopted, yeah, from a oh, pup dog rescue. Oh. She was the one who attached herself to you, Michelle, I and would not her. move. I thought you were going to adopt her that day. I think I we know. all were going to adopt <laughs> those dogs that day. But she found her home last, uh, last weekend, so she's uh, living the good life. Too. Oh, she's adorable. Yeah. That's great. We're now, are both of her brothers adopted yet? Every, all of the three oh. puppies have been adopted <gasps> now. Yeah. Well, we thank yeah. our viewers for that, and thank Perfect. you for making yeah. that happen. And yes. you guys have a big fundraiser coming up, which I love the name of it as much as the goal <laughs> of anything. Yes. Bark at the Moon Bark at the Gala. Moon Gala. It is a silent and live auction with a sit-down dinner, adoptable dogs from our partner rescues, um, raise the dog bone. <laughs> <laughs> it is fun. March 14th at Embassy Suites. Uh, you can go to our website, nwk9coalition.org, push on the button, click on the button for purchase your tickets. Oh, look at um, that. In and, Bellevue. Yeah, awesome. in Bellevue. And so this is going to help us raise some funds so that we can continue, continue to do the work that we're doing, you know, shining a light on dogs in need of a home, producing the videos, bringing them to the studio, transporting them. Making sure they have shots. I mean, all these yeah. things that like was once someone who just adopted a dog, you know, it, that can be expensive. Oh, and up. the fact that they're like, oh, this dog comes with all its shots, like that's hundreds mm -hmm. of dollars. You guys do need the, it the adds funds up. for it. it it's adds a really up. good cause. So, yeah, so with everyone's support, we can continue to fulfill our mission. Nice. Yeah. Okay, right. well, we'll be talking about that again, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, if you'd like to learn more about Chopper, we want to help everybody out, or any of the dogs at the other, um, yeah, any you dogs that are available. visit all our partner rescues on yes. our site. Yes. Yeah. All you have to do is text the word rescue to 206-448-4545. We'll send you a link to make it really easy for you. Thank you so much, Kathleen, for coming on in. Yes.